Watch Mitchell Dillman stealing woodworking on Amazon Fire TV. This episode brought to you by Cannibal Professional Nibbler and TrickTools.com. Welcome back. If you've been watching for the last couple of weeks, you've been able to see how we made this standing bar table and these matching bar stools. And during the course of making these, we've generated a lot of scrap metal. So I thought it'd be fun today to take a bunch of that scrap metal, spend the next few minutes, and I'll show you how we make some cool scrap metal art. So in the past, you may have seen some videos we've done making complex shapes like this with sheet metal. But I've had a lot of questions about simple little fun projects like this flower. And that's really what this is all about today, having fun. So we're going to take a handful of this scrap and we'll show you step by step how we made this flower. Then we may even finish up with something a little more complex. So the first thing we're going to do over here is take time to cut eighth inch strips off this tubing with our Ellis metal cutting bandsaw. So next, we've already taken time to set up our cannibal on the table mount. We're going to mark up the leaves on this 18 gauge sheet metal, go ahead and get them cut out. There we go. So there's really no wrong or right way to do it. You just cut out a bunch of little strips and no work for leaves. It's pretty quick. It's about all it takes. It's about what we're looking for, but you can see right there at the bottom. All right, so this is really pretty simple. First thing we're gonna do is get us a Get our piece held up here with a vise. I want to take time to cut out about a quarter of an inch out of the bottom of one of these. And that'll be our first piece. We'll weld it right there like that. Before we weld though, we want to take time to turn down the settings on our welder. Get it turned on. a little bit. And we're just going to go around the full circle, keeping them spaced out about three quarters of an inch down there. like a flower. It's time to put some leaves on it. It's 
take a look. We can take a minute and fill in this center hole. I think that does it. it looks alright, doesn't it? Alright, so we've got a few of these welded up. Now it's just a matter of getting them painted. Alright, we've got the color on. Let's shoot the middle one. Shot of yellow. Now we'll just take the plastic bag, cover the tops. Spray paint the rest. Make sure to get it all green. All right, so we're gonna let these dry, head in there and finish up the woodwork. So this project's all about using up scrap. We're gonna use up some of this leftover firewood to make some of these bases. So that's one creative way we've come up with to use up some of our scrap materials. I appreciate you taking time to watch. Be sure to go check out our sponsors at tricktools.com and Cannibal Professional Nibbler. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again next week.